Hi guys, Drakkar here. Welcome back to the channel, or if you're new, then welcome. We are here for a brand new release trailer for a very old game, uh, but one of the best games of all time, The Witcher 3. It's The Wild Hunt. It is the complete edition, and it is the next-gen update. Uh, very, very excited for this. I am a huge, huge fan of The Witcher. In case you can't tell, I thought I'd bring all my things just to prove it. Um, but yes, very, very excited for this. I don't know a lot about it. I just know it's a next-gen update for this game um, that will upgrade graphics. I think they're going to include some things that tie in with the Witcher series on Netflix. Um, and also, well, I think that's pretty much all I really know. So I'm excited to see this trailer. Hopefully it'll give us a little bit more information about what to expect. So yeah, let's just jump straight in, have a little look, and then have a little discussion afterwards. Got my pendant ready. I've got my little vial of mutagens, which I've already taken before the video. We've got all our friends here, ready to go. Let's check it out. Nilfgaard's crossed the Pontar in the east. Means war's coming. War changes everything. By order of the Hierarch, whosoever conceals a mage in their home shall burn alongside him or her. Nilfgaard on one bank, Redania on the other, drooling over the city like dogs over a juicy bone. We are at war. And she's in danger. You will find her and bring her to me. Fire! She's a child of the Elder Blood. Sit down. I gotta find Siri. And if you find her, the girl will die. <laughs> Our world will burn! Burn in the eternal fire! Why are you helping her? Because she's a danger. A mortal one. A power that can destroy the world. You must find her, Geralt before the Wild Hunt does. I will find her, or someone who knows what happened to her. Who are you? You know who I am. Oh, the music. legend cannot be killed, can it? will be here soon. They're coming for Siri. Hold them back! Yeah. I've long awaited this, and you might wolf. December 14th, yep. Yeah. Not long at all. Oh man. It got me hype! It got me hype! The music! The Witcher music is phenomenal and I think the TV show actually done a really great job with the music as well because it made it feel very Witcher straight from the straight from the off. Uh, I want to just go back to this little screen here. Oh, there was, so we, oh, I think it was there. There you go. There's the the Nilfgaard armor from the from the series. The well, the the, the well the well loved armor that, that no one hated whatsoever. I didn't think it was as bad as people made out. It wasn't the coolest, but it was it was a little strange. Yeah. With new content inspired by the Netflix series. So it'll be interesting to see exactly, especially with the news of what happened with Henry Cavill. It'll be interesting to see what they actually bring to the game from the series. Are they just going to bring in uh, some of the storylines from the series? Because obviously they included and brought in their very own stuff, kind of like what the game has done. Brought in their own lore and things into the the Witcher universe, um, especially season two with the overarching villain theme that was kind of made up for the series. Be interesting to see if that's included and how if she becomes part of the Wild Hunt in the game. The Wild Hunt will be here soon. They're coming for Siri. Yes. Yeah, so we've got here Four textures plus four K textures, sorry, plus models, ray tracing features, improved gameplay, photo mode, cloud saves, sixty FPS mode. So these are all the improvements that they're making, plus the content from the Witcher series. Uh, plus it's free, which is pretty great. So if you already own a copy of the game, I'm so I mean I've got the actual uh, physical <laughs> physical copy of the game. Uh, so. 
I'm, I'm assuming it still works for that, even if it is the physical copy of the game. Uh, but I also may just re-download it as well onto the PC, but we're undecided on that. But yes, I'm just very, very excited for it. It looks really cool. It just I've not played it in a little while, The Witcher 3, but it definitely got me... It immediately makes me want to play it. And I think that's the point of the whole trailer, isn't it? And it says, for a new generation. So hopefully, uh, it does attract people that haven't played the game before. It took me a while to play the game. Uh, purely because it was I, I heard how massive it was. Um, and... Uh, but as soon as I started playing it, I couldn't stop playing it. And I think I completed it uh, fairly, not quickly, but like uh, in a very brief time. I didn't prolong it. I just kept playing and playing because it was just a phenomenal game. So I'm very excited to revisit that. Also on my channel right now, we are currently playing through, for the first time, The Witcher 1, the Enhanced Edition. I'm doing a Let's Play of that. Um, and we're only a couple of, one episode in. So... If you enjoy The Witcher at all, um, please make sure you hit the like and subscribe button. Uh, subscribe to the channel. We will be doing a lot of Witcher content. Unsure if we're going to play The Witcher 3 uh, straight away. I mean, it's very tempting, but I kind of think I want to finish The Witcher 1 and then probably go on to Witcher 2 and then we'll get to Witcher 3. Um, gives it time as well to get a feel for what people say. If it's... I mean, it, it, you know what, I don't even care if people say it's not worth it, I'm going to be playing it anyway. I can't imagine many people will say it won't be worth it, because the, the original game was so incredible. Improved graphics, improved speeds, improved uh, everything. I, I just, I can't see how this is anything but a win for The Witcher. Um, and great, I think it's a great move from CD Projekt, because uh, they've got, they've also announced the, the remake of the trilogy as well. So this We'll get people hyped for it and then keep keep us going, keep us tidies over until uh, the release of the updated trilogy. So I'm making my way through the original trilogy right now on the channel and then hopefully by the time we get through all three of those, we'll be getting closer and closer to the actual uh, remakes of the game. So I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, leave us a little like, subscribe and I'll hopefully catch some of you witchers uh, on the channel. Skull! Oh.